Well, how's it going, everybody? My name is Trippikus, and welcome back to more Teardown, where for once in a very long time, we will be taking a look at the career mode once again, because I kind of got caught up with modding and enjoying that so much that I completely forgot about the career mode. But I'm actually also enjoying that bit. The earlier missions are just super boring, which is why I haven't really uploaded any recordings on that. But we are making some progress here and we have some funny missions for today. So I think we should get right back into those. I removed all of the mods that I could, but I honestly couldn't be bothered about replacing the pipe bomb with the non-human guy because it's freaking humans we're throwing around still. So I I mean, we're going to have to keep that one. And hopefully these will be able to help us or just cause even more chaos than necessary as we progress through more of the career missions here. So for today, we have to steal some massive safes over at Lee Chemicals. We need those GPS devices that we or encryption keys for the decryption keys. Wow, that was a hard thing to say for the GPS devices that we stole last time. Thanks for taking care of the GPS devices. Just one problem. They seem to be of a new, more secure type and I can't find out of their recent locations without the decryption key. My best bet is that Lee keeps the decryption key in his office safe, but it might also be in the production safe. I have one last favor to ask for you, and I think you already know what that might be. Well, heavy lifting, let's see what this mission is all about. Okay, so we made it to Lee's chemicals here, and this time we have to get to the boat. So I actually think I've seen this mission before now. Oh god, we have the weapons mod on. Maybe we should turn that off. I don't know. Is that cheating? I feel like we can make some fun with it nevertheless. Uh, so just blowtorch this away too. And get out of here because it's that's just better than getting in there on the regular way. Oh, dump truck. We can probably use that. So let's start up by looking at the map here. See what we have to go. Oh, there is a lot of things we have to grab here. Let's just go take a look at the mission here. So first of all, the two safes are in here. Are you not gonna let me in? Here. Now that's not locked anymore. So the safe should be up here somewhere. On the other side of this, maybe? Hello? Oh, right there. Perfect. Then we have another safe over there, I think. It should... Yep. So these are relatively close to each other, which is quite nice. I would love to maybe just... It's going to explode, isn't it? Nope. Good. Like, what, what happens if I just do that? That's not too bad. We don't have to watch out for any fire alarms or anything. So that's a good thing. I just want to use these to blow a hole in the wall there, because if we can avoid using our own stuff, then I would very much appreciate that. So just blow another hole there. Little bit of fire, but it is nothing that we can't control in case it gets a bit out of hand. But for now, it's looking pretty good. Oh, get up here. Please stop there. Nice. And oh, yep, that was definitely not the what I meant to do. Uh, what I'm thinking, what if we just drove the dump truck over here? And I, th I wonder, can we park that so we can dump both of them in? That's something I would love to know. I don't know if that's why they so conveniently placed this here, but it could definitely look like it. So if we just reverse in here and get some of this wall down there i'm thinking that we we park it right here okay we park it so that we can dump it down there and then the other one is is straight up there so what we can then do is if we carve a nice hole into this house then we can actually just drive the dump truck straight through and i and i think that's probably what we are going to try to do we can just use this over here to to do that so if we grab this and then we just start making a nice little Oh, that's a sturdy wall all of a sudden. What is... I'm kind of thinking... I just want a quick save here because I'm, I'm thinking if we can make that just dangle from the wall in, or if that's going to destroy the wire. Let's try. So then, if I just lift up the shovel a bit, nothing too much. Because the more we can clear here, the better. Now this... Oh, this is what I fear. Yep, that set it off. <laughs> While I do think that we are onto something here, then I just think that we also have to be kind of careful not to... Oh, God, no. Good. Not to take down more than necessary. But we need this wall going, that's for sure. And still don't destroy the dump truck, at least not too much. And then if we just go full speed... No! Guess we didn't need that anymore. I mean, for the very last bit, we can probably just use the dump truck here, honestly. All we just need is a nice path where we make sure that this one is not stuck so let's maybe just clear out a little bit of this rubble here so i cleared most of the rubble out there which means that i think we can now reverse this in and park it just perfectly where 
the safe has to drop. And maybe we can actually even get that in there without triggering the alarm just yet. So we'll save some time. Let's try just shooting out most of the flaws here. Oh, crap. And I think we got these safes as open and vulnerable as we can get without fully shooting them down just yet. As you can see, both of these are kind of just balancing on a tiny, tiny note here. So that should potentially save us enough time. I kind of want to get this one up. So I'm just going to grab the crane from over here because I would like to just get a little bit more of that building torn down. I don't think we're ready to leave that one just yet. We are going to go by the approach that is uh, speed running this uh, for world records. So I'm not just going to let this let this sit at a somewhat almost finished level. We are going to have to fit. Can what what what? What? Why? Oh god, I don't know if we can actually pull that one up. I don't know, I, we probably need these planks, but I just kind of want to see if we can plank this one to the ground. I don't know if that's going to hold us... Any... Nah, maybe not. I don't really know when this became a rescue mission for for a digger, but it, it, it just did. Okay, don't question it. Well, 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 would you look at that? I mean, we can just... Yeah, I'm sure this is fine too. There we go. That should be enough of that house taken down so that we should be able to get, get the dump truck in there nicely. Good. Well, we got the two safes set up and all ready to go. I'm just going to see if this works. So what we'll do is that we'll come running this way from, I think, over here somewhere. We're going to have the shotgun ready. Shoot up there. Get in the... Tr yeah, great start. We're just going to quick save it here again because then if we shoot that... What? Before you came down in one shot, now I shot four times and you're not going to come down. But then, now when I shoot this. This. Oh, yep. And then the safe goes and we'll get over here. So I see we definitely have to do some adjustments as we drive onto this one. But then right around there, we'll jump out. We'll shoot this. Oh, come on. <laughs> we'll shoot that. The second safe falls straight down into and we got both of them. That's perfect. So if we whip out the spray cane and we just kind of measure this as our parking spot for the truck, then let's see if we can fit inside of those. Because again, it has to be perfect. Nothing short of perfect is going to work for this mission. So from here, or this is probably where we're going to end, but we're going to come flying from there to there and there. So we should start over there. That is exactly what we are going to do. I'm just going to borrow this truck because I don't know what else to do with it. Oh, actually, maybe I know exactly what to do with it. Oh, yes, that's a fine path we made here. That is going to be just fine for this mission. So let's get back out on the road and almost go through their gate. All right, so looking at this, some of the documents should be in here. And I'm actually thinking if we park the truck right here that's not too bad then what we can do with that is shoot a little bit of a hole right here yep there it is oh god i am running low on shots now can we jump up there yes we can nice now this is where the pipe bombs would have been handy but since we don't have any pipe bombs well I guess technically we do. It just comes with a human. <laughs> I kind of want to make a hole right there. Yeah, that'll work. Why not? Is this cheating, by the way? I don't think it is, but let me know if you guys think I'm cheating if I'm doing this. What if we just create a nice little ramp here where we can where we can jump up? That's actually not too bad. Hmm. So as you can see, we can actually jump up there quite nicely. Oh, hello there. I don't think we should use too many pouts from that. That's probably just cheating. <laughs> Now, my hopes is that we can plank our way over to that bit right there. And I think we did it. That was very neat. That was very, very neat. As you run here and you're going to come running from here and then jump up here and then jump. Oh, but again, just speed running through here. Jump. Oh, my. And as I said, speed run through here. Now, we do have to find a way into this building here. And unfortunately, I think we are going to have to use some more of our resources here, even though we are running low on practically every single bit of ammo. All right. And there's one of the keys. So now we only have to find out how do we get up on the roof here, because that's kind of the approach that we took. What I'm thinking is that we just light this building on fire and let this burn out for a bit and see how much of the roof is left after we've done this. And then I'm going to consider if that's going to be enough to get up to the truck and into the next one there. 
And since this is after... Oh, no, okay. Uh, there is a fire alert. I did not think there was... The question is, can we burn... I was going to feed the fire some extra some extra wood here. But I'm thinking if we can burn this roof without the fire alarm going off. Because we are making a nice hole into it. And I actually don't think we need any more fire over here. So get all of this away. Still a bit of fire here. And just kill this too. Wait, was that it? Oh, that was it. Nice. Good. Oh, this is a perfect route. So, we have the route as following right now. We should get up here. We have to continue all the way up here. And jump. Run over there. There. Try not to get caught in any of these holes. Run this way. Up through here. Just gonna make an arrow there so we can see what we have to do here because otherwise I'm gonna do that. Good thing we have a bridge of naked men here, <laughs> which is kind of strange, not gonna lie, but I will use it for now because I don't know what else to do. Perfect, so let's just try that again. Up here, jump, jump, jump. Nope. Up here. Oh, that's good. That's perfect. So then, more spray. Break in this, there. Run, 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 and jump. Perfect. Now, what do we have to take in here? I think we have to take some keys to something. Hello? Oh, it's down there. So, potentially, we could just fly straight through. There we go. Just a massive hole right here so that we're sure to fall through it. Grab that one. Run, 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 run. Up here. Jump. Oh, what's there? Because the other one is in that house. And that is on the first floor. So I think it's better if we just go to the first floor again over here. Perfect. And good thing is that we can use these to smash the wall. Or maybe not these. These are not very sturdy, but these are. Oh, well, there. So now we already have a nice hole into that bit there, which we can then jump to. Come down here. Fall through. Now, that is actually a pretty damn good route, if I should say so myself. Oh, there's explosives here, so we can actually just make this hole over here just a little bit bigger. That's a good, that's a good hit. That's a good, that's a proper, proper hole we're making there. Just gonna get one more, because I would like to see that wall not to be so, such a sharp angle there. So, there. Now, that is gonna be very easy to get through. Let's just get out here because we need to paint some, some spray can stuff here again so we can see where we actually have to go. Well, I do guess that there is only one thing left to do, and that is try this out. So that is exactly what we are gonna do. All right, here goes nothing in... No, I'm not ready for this. I'm not mentally prepared. Let me just give me a second here. <laughs> yeah, we can do this. In three, two, one, grab this and run, run, run. That was very quick that I get stuck there. Now, we do have two planks left over, so I kind of want to play that one safe because I'm not liking the this weapon mod. Oh, my God. As I was saying, we do have two planks left, <laughs> which are here. So what I'm thinking is that we might just, I don't know, plank this as well. That's probably going to make life just a little bit easier. So let's try again in three, two, one, and pick up that one, run up here, jump. In here. Oh my god, this is perfect. And as far up as possible, jump all the way down, pick up upstairs again. Oh, this is gonna be a very good time. Pick this one up. We still have 38 seconds at this point, and this is the first run. What is going on there? Catch the safe. We caught it perfectly. Stop right here. Ah, the shotgun. Oh, no, we didn't get it. Oh, are you actually kidding me? Just come on down here. That's why I left this one, so I should have just used this. Well, I think we're going to have to do it again, but now at least we can see how much damage this, this cause. Not enough that we lose the safe, so that's what we're going to do. Just, I'm definitely liking the, uh, the show here that we put up, so we can make it very fast time here. So in three, two, one, pick up the target there. Run, 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 run up there. Oh god, this is gonna be another very speedy run. And down into the hole, pick that one up. I mean, I'm not sure, but this honestly looks like it might even be faster than the previous one. Good vibes here, good vibes. And just give this one a good whack into the truck. Stop here. Where's the explosives? Throw that one there. Oh no, we dropped it, no! Grab this. Oh, that was so slow. Oh my, I hate that safe. Grab that one perfectly. Get out of here.
I hate you so much, game. Let's see if we can just do this. Smack that. All right, running again. Okay, we made it to the safes once more. There, we called the first one perfectly. Stop right there. Grab this one. Good. Now, don't mess up the throw. It's in. Now we just have to go. Drive, you good thing. Then don't hit the water. Wow, why is it so slow? Oh my god, this truck is actually horrible. Why did I ever put my money on this one? This is literally gonna be so close. That was so close. I thought I had so much time and we have a freaking second left. What? So yeah, I honestly expected more from that, but what do you know? <laughs> well, that was another job well done. And let's see what we have now. Water tower. Hmm. Oh, right. Okay, so the woman to tear down this water tower here. That's going to be something for another episode because this was a long but very successful teardown. Did indeed enjoy this. Are these slowly fixing up the car here? Does it look like any, any more fix than last time? Oh, also, we should start checking out what happens to the house here as we go about clearing up more and more. The kitchen looks nicer and nicer. He still didn't move his bed inside of the... Let me help you with that. There. Very good. And just for good measures, let's get rid of this as well. There. Perfect. That's also done now. So for next time, if you guys want to see more campaign, we are going to take down the water tower. Thank you so much for staying around. And until next time, stay safe. Bye bye.